Welcome back, everybody. You already know this your girl heaven sent. I want to thank all my subscribers. I truly appreciate y'all. Okay, so this is going to be your emergency blackout for the weekend. Keep in mind this re is general and it may not resonate with no damn body. You see what I'm saying? No. Let me tap right in. Because the main energies for the collector for this weekend, it's like, okay. Somebody is worried about what you doing when they not around, okay? It's a fear here. It's a fear of wasted time. Like someone wants to put all this time and energy into the situation dealing with you, okay? I feel like they already put a lot of time in. But... The way this person is thinking is kind of negative, okay? They feel like you could be doing certain shit when you not talking to them or when you not around them. I feel like right now in your life, you going through these positive changes, okay? I feel like you are just inspiring to others you know people could be looking up to you you shining bright I feel like the glow up is real around this bitch like it's it's not your fault that you just evolving you know what I'm saying like you can't help but to change all right you can't help it and this person could be threatened by the changes that you are going through in your life right now I feel like this person is worried about speaking facts speaking truth being honest because I feel like at this point dealing with this person it's like, look, when I ask you a motherfucking question, I expect the truth around this bitch. The honest answer. Like, I don't need no stuttering. I don't need no confusion. I don't need a motherfucker scratching their motherfucking head and trying to come up with some shit. Not at this point. It's like this person know moving forward that they're going to have to be honest and direct and clear about anything that's going on between you two it's a feeling like if they don't they're gonna lose you for good that you're gonna move forward and you might who wouldn't like who wants to deal with a motherfucker who can't be honest with a motherfucker you know what i'm saying ain't nobody got time for that shit it's like be serious be truthful, be honest, be yourself. You know what I'm saying? Like, just keep it fucking 100 at the end of the motherfucking day and everything will be all good. That's where the worrying is coming in at. Like, they know this time around, any type of feeling where a motherfucker is it's not making sense, it's like, yeah, okay, play with it if you want to. You know what I'm saying? Because I feel like even though this person is worried for what? That's their business. You know what I'm saying? That's them negative thoughts that they got in their motherfucking mind. Because what I'm seeing is you have good intentions. Your intentions is good. Now, when it comes to you over emotional and clingy, like, no. You just you know could be just giving a motherfucker a space and you know i'll see you when i see you i guess and i'll talk to you when i talk to you and like before you could have been clingy you know before you could have been chasing before you could have just been like oh i just want to be around this person all day you not in that space no more don't get me wrong you love this person you can't hide that you can't hide that part within you okay you got a heart spe a heart 
you got a soft spot for this person. You love this person. But your actions is different now. I feel like you thinking before you do any motherfucking thing now. Because at first you could have just been jumping the gun around this bitch. You know what I'm saying? And it's like now, you know what? Whew. Let me get on my introspection shit. Let me think before I take any type of action. Now this person worried. It's like, okay, what the fuck? are you doing you know what i'm saying it's like that type of shit because i feel like the offer is on the table the offer been on the table the relationship is there the union is there to happen you know what i'm saying but i feel like when it comes to this ghosting energy or some shit that's not there some shit that keep getting brought back the fuck up it's like it's time to transmute that shit Whatever is there, it's like, transmute that. Let's talk about some shit that's happening today. You know what I'm saying? It's like that shit. Stop bringing up this old shit. And things can move forward. Because the lines of communication are open. You talk to this person. You may not talk to them like you used to. But the communication, the lines of communication is open. You just not reaching out first like you normally do. That's when this person is getting worried. Anxiety. Can't motherfucking sleep and shit. That's their thoughts. So, yeah. That's the main energy around this bitch. Keep in mind the main energy is, is the, like the title for the read for the new motherfuckers. Okay. So pretty much you could be dealing with a person who is worried and stressed the fuck out on what the fuck you doing when you not around their asses and you not doing shit. But living your motherfucking life, you know, trying to be better than you was yesterday. You still got love for this person. You always going to have love for this person. It's like the offer on the table. What the fuck is the problem? You know what I'm saying? So, yeah, that's pretty much the main energies around this bitch. Let me jump right into it. Now, the overall of this, it's, it's a feeling like, okay, it shouldn't even be nothing negative going on around this motherfucker. You know what I'm saying? I feel like everybody money good, the foundation good. Like, what is there to worry about again? You know what I'm saying? Why is motherfucker stressed the fuck out? It's like, I'm at peace around this motherfucker. Like, I'm at peace. I feel like it's just requiring patience you know because it's some detached energy around this motherfucker you could just be detached it's like okay i get back to you when i get back to you like i, I you know i missed your call i'm gonna call you back it's just, i'm not gonna be quick to pick up your call like it's like patience is required in this situation and i feel like you may have to learn that that was a lesson that you needed to learn like damn let me learn how to de detach myself from this person I feel like when it comes to the the drama and the impulse, motherfuckers ain't on that shit no damn mo. They free from that, okay? They free from it. I feel like this person needs to know, like, it's safe to love. You are protected. You know what I'm saying? Like, them fucking with you would be a good thing. Put it like that. You excite exciting to them you know what i'm saying you bring excitement to their life it's nothing to worry about it is like ain't no need to think negative about you you know what i'm saying it's like what the fuck your intentions is pure and good it's like i don't know who the fuck you used to fuck with but i'm not them it's like i don't know how many times i'm gonna tell you this shit you know what i'm saying that's like that's a little rough because the situation i'm looking at it's like it's all good it's all love it's all support like anything you want i got you this is the real deal like i'm telling you what the fuck i want and i want is you like you may feel like this is divine and faded and shit you know what i'm saying you own that shit i feel like right now you making moves like you making moves that you haven't made before like 
you're in a powerful energy where it's like, okay, I could do anything I motherfucking want. Like you in that fucking energy, like you unstoppable. And I feel like this person is worried because you in that energy. You unstoppable. You untouchable. You know what I'm saying? It's like that feeling. You confident as fuck. You know what I'm saying? You holding your head up high. You don't look down on motherfuckers. You know what I'm saying? It's just you know where the fuck you going. I feel like you working hard on your confidence. You know what I'm saying? You working hard on that mind over matter. Your mind is powerful. You have a strong mind. And this person, I feel like, is just scared of you breaking their heart. And you don't know this. This is a secret. Like, on some real shit. This is a secret. It's like, they know you can have anybody you want. That's a threat. Because I feel like you in this energy where you don't want for shit and you don't need this person at all to fulfill any type of stability in your life. None of it. It's all taken care of. I feel like this person has manifested love into their life. And they thought they, they thought it wasn't going to never work. You know, like they wasn't never going to find someone to love them as equal as they love you. Like they thought that wasn't going to never happen. They thought it was just going to always be some one-sided shit. And that's not the motherfucking case. I feel like you love this person just as much as they love you. It's just, you could have pulled back some of your love because you may have overextended your love to this person I feel like you looking at the situation like no need to take it personal when it comes to you just standing up for yourself protecting yourself that's how you're looking at it. Like, you're protecting yourself. It's not the personal, you know? It, I mean, it's personal for me, but when it comes to you, don't even, you know, it's like, when it comes to them, it's like, don't even look at it like, oh, I'm just doing this because I'm selfish or... No, it's like, okay, I'm protecting myself because I already know what I, I, my actions were in the past dealing with it. So it's like, okay, let me not make the same mistake because this is coming from like long term well off like got it made around forever life partner like it's coming from all that energy where it's like it's something that's already built the fuck up it's coming from a foundation that's already built something set in stone an energy where it took a lot of work to get to this level like that's where this shit is really coming from and it's like okay why are you worried again you know what I'm saying it's like that it's like this is leading to it's gonna work out between you two I feel like this person is going to show you a lot of love by their actions, okay? They're going to start doing shit for you that they may haven't done in the past. And I feel like it's going to bring you too closer. The bond is going to get stronger. But I feel like you're going to have some past people return. And dealing with these past people, 
this could be with you and with the other person they could be going through the same shit where past people is going to return that it ended like it hurt it when it ended okay it was like a terrible ending it's a feeling of a motherfucker got robbed okay these people gonna feel like they have got robbed that's the feeling but it's over these people want closure because it's a presence of energy around where it's like the star positivity inspiring looking up to it's just healing the energy is healing and these people or this person in from the past not the one that you connected to now the these people from the past it's like they want closure they want closure so they can know what direction to go towards they want to make sure that they can't come back this way and i feel like they gonna know that that they can't come back this way it's like no 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 you can't manifest this way you know what I'm saying? You cannot sit with us like that. I feel like dealing with these these past people, it was something with a dream or something with a fantasy. And I feel like you could be that ideal person that they want to be with. But they had their shot. And they missed. And moving forward, it's nothing but love. It's nothing but positivity with you two that you with now, the person that you connected to now. It's nothing but just passion and excitement and new shit and positivity and happiness and laughter and fun and sex, like good sex, like funny sex. It's like it's just gonna be positive coming up. You know what I'm saying? The energy is light and fucking bright, you know. I feel like it's gonna be hot and horny no doubt but i feel like it's just gonna be new beginnings moving forward from now on i feel like y'all two gonna be on new shit you know what i'm saying and just living life and just being happy period so yeah that's pretty much all i got y'all for the weekend so this is you already now (laughs) so yeah thumbs the fuck up y'all if that shit is making sense and um I'll see y'all on the next one. Peace out, y'all.